Hi, this is Lola from War Room Games and I'm going to show you how to play Magic. This is going to be a quick and easy introduction on the five main phases of your turn in any Magic game. Let's get started. Before we get going, you want to make sure that you have your deck shuffled and cut by your opponent and make sure that you draw at least seven cards. At the beginning of your turn, remember U, U, D. Untap, upkeep, and draw. Untap any permanents in play. If any of your permanents have an upkeep, follow through with them and then draw for turn. Play your land for turn. Lands are your currency in this game, which leads us to the next step, casting creatures and spells. Use the mana in play to cast spells and creatures from hand. But wait, how do I know what a creature or spell costs? Well, we'll take a look at the upper right hand corner of the card in question. The symbol with the number on it means you can use any no mana, no matter the color. The symbols with the picture on them mean you need that much of that symbol. I have a planes in play, so I'm going to cast this creature here. To indicate that I have spent my mana, I'm going to tap and put my creature into play. Creatures that just entering the battlefield have a condition called summoning sickness. It means that they can only sit around, they can block, but they can't attack and they can't use any of their abilities. Combat phase is what follows. Tell your opponent who or what is attacking, then your opponent declares who will block. Dealing combat damage follows suit. Then we move on to our second main phase. We repeat everything from the first main phase if possible. If you haven't played a land for turn, this would be the time to do so. If the mana if you have the mana available, you can cast creatures and spells. Lastly, our end step. All creatures who are damaged during your turn heal and then you pass a turn. And that's how you play magic. This is Lola with War Room Games and I'll see you guys next time for card types.